Hello everyone and welcome back. Uh, this is uh, Faris from uh, a Funny Horror Animation. How are you today? Uh, so uh, as you can see here, today we have uh, this uh, part of animation. Uh, this is our company and this is our channel. And uh, today I'm going to talk uh, a, little bit, a little bit more about the animation. I got uh, lots of comments of uh, my channel, also my company notes that um, lots of people that uh, want to learn more about uh, the animation and how we make the animation. So today I'm here with you guys to uh, explain and show you more about the animation. Uh, we are using 3D uh, software, as you can see here. And I'm going to take this video as uh, an example. So let's start. This is a video, for example, we took around uh, two weeks to make this video because we have much uh, an issue with the animation of character like helicopter model, uh, also the granny and scary picture. So as you can see here guys, this is an example for an animation that we made. Uh, we have also uh, 1 million channels here as you can see. And we hope our funny horror channel uh, hits uh, 1 million subscribers. We already hit uh, 170,000 subscribers and this is uh, pretty good. So let's... Uh, Let's start our uh, animation and let's see how we make uh, this animation. Come on, come on. This is funny. So, we will talk about this uh, video that I'm showing here. So, let's start this. So, as you can see here, we are using a 3D animation software. And if we uh, come back to the frame that uh, on the software, we can we put uh, zero for the camera show to select your camera. And you, as you can see here, this is uh, the helicopter. So if I run the frames, as you can see here, the helicopter is uh, going to uh, hit uh, and pick up, uh, hit the air, uh, the roof, and pick up uh, this shadow too. There is granny and scary kitchen. So if, you, if we select the bone and uh, switch to pose mode, as you can see here, we will find the pose. And of course we can uh, move the pose uh, with the G. Sorry, I select the old pose. So we can rotate it with uh, the G. And there is the finger. So if I wanna take the finger here, I will use R and G to move the whole boom. Uh, let's take uh, other character for example. So here is the uh, granny. I'm going, to, I'm going to select the head. So if I wanna make the head go like this, I put I click this and I click on I on the keyboard and select this as you can see here location rotation both location rotation both two not only one two to make the bone move the completely move and then here is the bone so as you can see here in frame number five seven eight or nine I think there is a move there is a K for the animation so this K telling the character to move from the roof to the hallway character so if we if we look at the helicopter inside the helicopter you can see here the granny character with the scary kitchen uh, also we are putting our uh, logo here to save our copyrights as you can see here, this is uh, the logo on our, on our helicopter model. So the helicopter is moving through and flying. And it's going to 
parameters instead. So, uh, most uh, common that I, I got uh, lots of people that asking me uh, how can we uh, move many character or how can we put many uh, keys on the in one time many keys on many character more than one character on one time so you have to click on shift and select the other tunes like this I will select the old tunes then I switch to boost mode and then I will find that I've been choose the all pool and I have I can control all the pools as you can see here. So if I wanna for example move the, the all head heads that here I granny heads I grant the bar back siren heads created shine head so I click on shift and select the bone then select the second pool I, I keep uh, clicking on uh, on shift on the mouse uh, sorry on the keyboard and I choose the all hit pin. so I've been choose the all hit pin. so if I click on R I will put it all the hits as you can see here so you can make comedy or funny uh, videos with this look this is uh, <laughs> insane uh, anyway this is the head for example so if I wanna repeat on Z axis I click R and Z and all the heads will rotate around Z axis as you can see here so cool uh, let's uh, choose the legs for example all born for legs on the neck security chart and let's rotate on x axis so as you can see if we wanna for example make them uh, kick or something like this as you can see we are kick at the same time and this is good so if I wanna make the rotation around the axis, I click R, Z, and all the buttons rotate around the axis. So if I wanna make a keyframe, I click I, location, rotation, and then move the key, and click I, location, rotation. So the character moving here because we already have a uh, different start. But before. So we are making them dance. Uh, this is the part that shown here. This is the helicopter. Yeah, so as you can see here. We are dancing. Yeah. This part, while we are dancing, you can see it here. We are dancing. This is the part. And if you guys want to see the helicopter part, is the helicopter part. So this is 100% to belong to us, to our company. So. There is part that I'll show you in the software. To use it to All right. So we've seen this part here. Character and the helicopter are going to land. It's going to land. Yeah, and they are going to pick up the people into the helicopter. They uh, pick up them and yeah, very people. So I hope you guys uh, get some benefits from this. 
uh, tutorial today. I thank you very much for supporting us and of course we are always waiting for your uh, uh, comment and I will uh, review me and my team with my team, my company, the all comment and I will make you a new tutorials for uh, animation and tutorials. Thank you so much. Please subscribe to help me. Oh my God.